everyone, how are you? So today I'm filming my August favorites. I'm excited to share with you guys what I've been loving throughout the month of August. There are so many products, so I just try to narrow it down to my very favorite. I am so ready for September and fall. If you guys have any fall related videos that you would like to see, whether they are get ready with me's or favorites videos, make sure to leave them in the comments below so I can film them for you guys. I'm super excited to do fall videos, so if you have any requests at all, leave them down below and I'll be sure to film them. Okay, so let me jump into my favorites. My first one is probably going to be an obvious one and that is the Urban Decay Naked 2 Basics palette. I have a review video so I'll link that down below if you guys want to check it out but I've absolutely been loving this palette. I am such a fan of the colors and the pigmentation. I think that it is absolutely beautiful and I know that I will be wearing it throughout the whole fall and winter months because I just think that the shadows coordinate so well with deep vampy lipstick or even nude lips and I really really love this. If you guys want to check out my whole review I'll make sure to link it down below. I will have a tutorial coming up using this very Another soon. Another eyeshadow palette or quad that I've really been loving this month is by City Color Cosmetics. Again, I have a whole video on City Color Cosmetics products. If you guys want to check it out, I'll link it down below. They are super affordable. So if you're looking for a really affordable option, I would definitely recommend their Color Basics palettes, especially collection number four. This is just filled with four neutral eyeshadows that are so gorgeous. I think it just creates a really beautiful, warm kind of golden smoky eye that's a little bit on the subtle side so this is super affordable honestly you cannot beat the price so I will link the website down below I think I have a coupon code as well so I'll link that down below if it's still available but I would definitely recommend trying these out. So I don't know about you guys but fall to me signifies the time to pull out the dark vampy lipsticks I actually saw Danny from Coffee Break with Danny in one of her videos the other day wearing Black Cherry by Milani and it looked so beautiful on her so I decided to pull mine out and wear it as well. It is such a gorgeous color, which this isn't my favorite because I just started pulling it out the past couple of days, but I definitely recommend so, it. So it's a recent favorite, but lipsticks that I've been loving throughout the month of August are from the Sola Look. Now, this is a company that I've heard about through YouTube, so I was super excited to try their lipsticks. First of all, the packaging is absolutely beautiful. They come in this box and they have a really gorgeous like illustration of a girl on here. And then the actual lipstick packaging is black with really pretty like pink purple writing on it. They snap close and you guys these lipsticks are so creamy. I'm obsessed with creamy lipsticks. I'm all about comfort when it comes to lip products. If they're dry or they make your lips feel dry I just I don't really like them as much as ones that feel so comfortable on the lips. These are so creamy and pigmented. You guys have to try these out. The ones that I've absolutely been loving are Diana which is a really pretty kind of um, like dark vampy red color. It's so beautiful and so pigmented. Perfect for the fall months. And if dark colors aren't your thing, I would also recommend this one, which is Jessie. I love this one so much if I'm wearing a smoky eye. It's just a beautiful kind of natural muted pink tone and it's just so creamy and pigmented. I will definitely be including these lipsticks in a tutorial coming up so you can see how well they work, but I'll include swatches because they are just so beautiful. I love that they're hydrating. I love that the packaging is so beautiful and I definitely recommend them. I will link them down below so you guys can be sure to check them out. So when it comes to wearing dark lipsticks, you don't want your lips to be dry because it's really noticeable, at least with dark lipsticks that I tend to wear. So what I've absolutely been loving is this e.l.f. Lip Exfoliator. I got this a couple of months ago and it is absolutely amazing. It's just a little lip exfoliator in lipstick form and you just kind of put it on your lips, rub them together and then rub it off and it just helps to exfoliate any like dry skin on your lips and make them absolutely smooth and perfect for lipstick applications. This is so inexpensive and it definitely beats kind of mixing your own because that gets a little messy and time consuming and you can just whip this out and apply it like a lipstick and it works perfectly well. So if you guys haven't tried this yet, I definitely recommend it. Okay, this is probably my most favorite product from the entire month. If I had to pick one, this has definitely been the one that I've been using the most. It is by Anastasia and it is their Dip Bow Pomade in Ebony. I love this, you guys. I got it and I put it in a haul video and I'll link that down below and I did like a mini review, but it is amazing. I never thought that I was going to like this product for my eyebrows because I'm an eyeshadow powder kind of lover for my eyebrows, if that sounds even makes sense, whatever I just said. I like using eyeshadows on my eyebrows, but I love this. It is like a gel liner consistency, but it just goes on so smoothly, and I think I just kind of like how my eyebrows look with it. They look a little bit... 
um, dramatic, which is what I like. I don't know how they look on camera, just because things tend to look different on camera, but I just, I love it so much. They don't move. It's so much easier to apply than I ever thought it was going to be. I'll do a video if you guys want to see how I apply it, but I really, really love it. If you guys haven't tried this yet, definitely pick it up. It is so worth the money. It's so worth the hype. It's just amazing. I really love it. I got this one in my BoxyCharm this month, which I love my BoxyCharm. I've gotten so many full-size products that I use on a daily basis, but I've really been loving this. This is by Ofra. It is the Americano Bronzer, and this bronzer is so beautiful. A couple of you were commenting that it looks really orange on camera, but I promise you it is the perfect color. Sometimes I just feel like bronzers in general are hard for me because either they're too orange or they're too brown and they don't look right on my skin tone. This one is so beautiful. I just use it to bronze up my face and it helps to give me a really gorgeous kind of subtle glow and I just love it. It does have shimmer in it, but I like that because it just, it looks, it kind of looks like you're glowing and it's so beautiful. I love the formula. It's really easy to apply and it blends out so beautifully you don't get like a harsh line or a muddy look or like a hard to blend bronzer this is really really nice I really like the brand Ofra Cosmetics I've gotten a lot of great things from them they're usually in my subscription services but they're really really great quality okay as for my random favorite this has been a lifesaver recently I absolutely love getting portable chargers for my iPhone or just for my I guess I was gonna say electronics but usually just my iPhone sometimes my iPad but whenever I'm out in public and my iPhone dies I, it, I just I get so annoyed because my iPhone battery dies pretty fast. I did get a new one, so it's not doing it as often, but it would seriously die after like three hours. So I'd carry one of these around and charge it, and it would charge it fully. This one charges it so quickly, first of all. Second of all, it will charge it up to two or three times. A lot of them only charge it halfway or just charge it a little bit. This one I can get two to three full charges out of, which is amazing. I cannot even tell you guys if you're out or if you have like a long day, like if you're going to like New York City for the day and you're doing some sightseeing. These are amazing to have because you use your phone for everything. I use mine to tell me where I'm going, what restaurants are around, shopping lists. I search things on the internet when I'm shopping. I just, I need it to stay alive. So I think that these are amazing. They fit in your purse. They fit in your pocket if you want. This one is RAV Power and I definitely recommend this brand. I've tried so many different ones, but I think that this one is the best that I've tried for sure. So if you guys are looking for a good external charger, I would definitely recommend this one. Okay, you guys, so I think that is the end of my August favorites. Make sure to leave me a comment down below letting me know what you've been loving during the month of August. I would love to hear from you guys. If you have any requests, make sure to leave them down below as well, and I hope that you guys have a great September, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!